Hi, I'm Phil Dispenza. This is Collecting, Investing, or Somewhere in Between. This is going to be an odd video. Uh, it's not a particular episode. Um, I'm not even too sure exactly what I'm going to call it. I considered calling it why. Um, you know, why anything? Why collect? Why invest? Why do videos? Why am I doing this? Um, why listen to other people? Uh, so uh, I'm not stopping this. I'm just going with it. I don't care if I make mistakes, bloopers. There's no notes. Um, of course, there's some car outside revving its engine. Anyway, um, why did I uh, decide to do these videos? Uh, I'm trying to inform people. Uh, you know, I give, even though, you know, my videos might be like an hour long, some of them are maybe even slightly more than an hour. I'm giving you information. I'm giving you detailed information. I might throw a story or two in there. I show you examples uh, of things, you know, different types of collectibles, you know, the comics, the video games, and whatever I am going to be doing in the future. I'll always have examples. Uh, hopefully I have more examples uh, of certain things. But, uh, you know, I'm going to cover a lot of things. Um, but... You know, I'm giving you an idea on what's out there, uh, you know, because you, you as a collector might not know that something existed. And, you know, I'm making you aware. Uh, you as an investor might want to choose a specific item to buy. Um, you know, I, I watched a video the other night. This is another one. You know, I, I was saying about misinformation. You know, I saw one guy with Atari games and, you know, he's got it graded and everything. But. Um, at least he was giving good examples to invest in. I watched some nonsense video, and the thing had 1.6 million views. I don't remember how old it was, but he had like top 10 collectibles. And it was so general. And the stuff he was showing, like for con he had comic books as one of the 10 items uh, in general, just comics. And he shows an Action 1, a Detective 27, and a Marvel Comics 1. Uh, and he says something in the beginning of the video is, uh, maybe you could find this in your house. No, you're not going to find these in your house. Uh, and, and as an in investor, investors aren't watching these types of videos. Uh, all they're doing is showcasing. You know, he's got fancy music. He's got little pictures and stuff. Uh, nothing. They, they don't physically show anything themselves. He, he's not on camera. All he hears is a voice. I just found it so annoying because... You know, I'm giving examples and I'm showing examples and, you know, I'm giving a variety. So it's not a 10 minute video. It's not an eight minute video. It's not a 15 minute video because I'm giving you a lot of information. And I just, you know, I, I just found it so annoying. He's like Pokemon cards. He shows a, a Pikachu, Japanese Pikachu that there's only five in existence. You're not going to find that in your house. I don't know if there's going to pick up loud or not. Um, then he shows uh, baseball cards. And he's like a, gr a graded 8-0 Mickey Mantle and a Babe Ruth and a Shoeless Joe Jackson. 99% of the time, you're not going to find these in your house. So, you know, I, I'm giving you information. This guy didn't. And, you know, I'm hoping that, you know, that you, know, you learn. You're learning something from this. And that's why I'm doing it. Uh, to help everybody, your average Joe, uh, you know, make intelligent decisions and uh, be aware. And I always say, do your homework and stuff. So, you know, why? Why? Because I, I actually like doing this. Uh, I like information. I was teaching at one point. I, I like, you know, having people learn from me. I, I have a vast amount of knowledge. I've been doing this a long time. I mentioned this in the introduction. So uh, I know I had a comment from one of my former customers, a uh, friend, Facebook friend. Uh, he put a comment in my intro saying, show, I think it was the comic intro, show examples. Uh, introductions, I'm not going to show examples. When I get into specific episodes, uh, that's when I'm going to bring up examples. So I, you know, I replied to his comment. So again, make your comments, uh, like, subscribe, share, uh, tell your relatives friends that you know who might collect something eventually you're going to see something unless you know i mean you you could just 
if you don't choose to spend your money on anything, you go buy a car, you go buy your house, buy a nice TV, a video game system that you don't collect, but you just do to play or something, you know, you have a choice. When you collect, collecting is an investment. And most of the times, uh, you know, if you wait long enough, it's going to be uh, a profit for you. You know, like I said, 35 years of collecting comic books. Somewhere along the line, I'm going to be making some money um, from what I spent. But, you know, it's it's up to you, investor. I, I'm going to throw the investment, you know, items out there. But, you know, investors, a lot of times they know what they're doing. So, again, this is for the little guy. I'm not showcasing little things like the guy. The other thing is annoying. I just found it so annoying. He puts a Chinese vase or something. Uh, that somebody had, I don't know if they had it in the house or something or other, or I don't remember millions and millions of dollars it was worth. You're not going to find this in your house. You know, 99.999% of you are not going to find things in your house that are going to be worth a fortune. Uh, you got to start small, um, unless you have money, then you can start big. But, um, I doubt unless you dig out your attic. And I mentioned this in the comic, uh, the first episode of the golden age comics, uh, you know, renovate, you just luck out because your house is old and something happens to be in your wall. Uh, you have a better chance of winning a lottery, uh, of besides, you know, finding something valuable in your wall, uh, besides dead animals or bugs or asbestos. So anyway, <laughs> I just felt like ranting a little and, uh, you know, I'm going to be releasing part two of the golden age. Um, not this weekend, but following weekend i gotta do it uh videotape it or whatever record it and videotape again i keep dating myself um so stay tuned for that and then we're gonna move on silver age and bronze age and all these other ages and stuff i'm gonna get into variations and errors and whatever I'm, i cover a ton of stuff and again it's information so if you want to watch it for the hour watch it for the hour if you want to skim through skim through skimming through you're not gonna really understand Unless you see something I, I'm showing up on the screen, skimming is not going to help you. Uh, so, you know, take some time, uh, you know, watch 15 minutes at a time for four days straight. And you'll get through the hour. I release them every two weeks. So you have plenty of time to watch, you know, a one hour video. Uh, you, you know, I see people wasting so much time doing other things. So, you know, if you're into collecting uh, any type of collectible, you know, somewhere along the line, you're going to learn something from me. So anyway, uh, see you when I do uh, my new videos. That'll be coming up soon. Anyway. All right. Bye.